leader, particularly a leader in the cryptocurrency space. Is being sassy on Twitter part of that? I don't. It seems like it is. Uh, no, I don't think. I, well, I don't intend to be sassy on Twitter. But uh, Elon Musk <laughs> has a huge following on Twitter, like sixty million uh, plus fans, and he's one of the uh, richest world, uh, richest person in the world, and he has a huge influence. Uh, what he tweeted um, there's, uh, he said, well, um, there, there is a uh, there is a withdrawal issue with Dogecoin on Binance due to a software upgrade of the Doge official wallet. This is by the Doge uh, developers, and um, but in his uh, in his tweet, he says sounds shady. Um, I'm not aggressive by nature, but I also am not submissive or cowardly when it comes to defending our business. I view that defending uh, Binance uh, as my job and uh, defending BNB uh, and crypto industry as my life's mission. So when he says something, when he says something about that, which is also incorrect, he lacks research. Um, the Dutch uh, develop the, the the Dutch Development Foundation actually tweeted about this issue uh, on November 12th, which is about 11 days ago. And there's a lot of details on what the issue is. So it's not that Binance is having the issue. It's the Dodge official wallet that has an issue. When he tweets something that's very inaccurate and says, sounds, sounds shady, I unfortunately have a job to defend my um, our business um, and also our industry. So I tweeted back at him. I said, "Look, we apologize for the inconvenience. I clarified the issue, and but I also I also did a <laughs> I also did a very quick search on Tesla." Less than like two weeks ago, they also had a recall of, of 12,000 vehicles in the in the U.S. I just thought, you know, we, could, we should be busy looking at that. You know, um, but I'm like I'm not against him personally. I'm not. I, I don't. I don't take it personally either. I think. I feel this is like a little bit of a friendly banter, and uh, it gets us. It gets us a little bit of a. Uh, it gives the Twitter community a little bit of entertainment, and um, yeah, I think it's okay.